Hey guys, today I'm going to talk with you about why you need expand and expand appearance. And let's start our tutorial. Select any color in the fill and any color in the stroke and select rectangle tool and draw the square. Here we have fill and basic stroke. You see we have here a basic line, it's very important. And let's make it fatter, let's make it 10, our stroke. Okay, now if I'm going to make this shape bigger or smaller, you see the stroke change its size. So, object. And if you select expand, you see it's selected. Here you need these options and OK. And if you now will be make it bigger or smaller, let's make it. You see, the proportions are great. They are become bigger or smaller when you make shape bigger or smaller. Now ungroup the square and you see here we have the fill and the same here with this frame we have the fill. Okay, let's delete it. Now again select rectangle tool, let's draw the rectangle with the same color and here we need black color in the stroke and now if you select not basic brush or and if you select any brush, for example, uh, this one, it's not basic brush. And now we go to object and you see you can select expand, you can select only expand appearance. So expand works only with basic brush and the other brush work only expand appearance. Okay, you see it's again fills. Now select again rectangle tool and draw rectangle like this. Okay, now go to effect, distort and transform and select this option. And let's play the options, for example, like this. And you see now we have the flower. So if we are going to make it bigger or smaller, you see the proportions are great and why you need to expand or expand appearance. So guys, illustrate, illustrator don't understand that it's the flower. It thinks that it's still the square. For example, select direct selection tool and we can here work only with these points. And you see Illustrator, Illustrator thinks on, it's only the square. You can select other points. And now if we make object expand appearance, okay, now you see you see the shape of the flower. Illustrator uh, understood that it's the flower and now you can select any point and work with it and you as well can add points with the help of this uh, tool and you can move these points and now you can play with the shape uh, and Illustrator know that it's the flower. Now let's delete it. And one more interesting tip. Let's open any raster photo. For example, this one from the last tutorial. Okay, hold and drag it. And now let's make image trace. Image trace. Okay, and now you turn a raster to vector, but you can't use it. You see, it's still locked. So, for unlock it, you need to press expand here or expand here. You see, you can select it. Okay, now 
ungroup their uh, file and move the palm leaf here and delete unwanted parts and now it's totally vector illustration and you can use it as you like and you can't do it without expand option.